Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're going to be doing this look. It's obviously not a look that's very natural. I mean, if you cry glitter tears, I guess it could be natural. But I really wanted to recreate this look. It is actually, um, I was inspired by Motel Bunny on Instagram and her art. It's just so freaking cute. I saw it last night while I was scrolling down and I was like, I have to recreate this. And so here it is. And if you guys want to learn how to cry glitter tears, just keep on watching. <laughs> Went ahead and did my eyebrows off camera and I am going to go in with the ColourPop Rose Quartz Priming Spray. I don't really use priming sprays. I always use um, like the, the regular primers. Never priming sprays, so I'm going to see how this works out for me. I wonder what it smells like. I can't really tell what it smells like. Okay, I feel like it sprays a little bit too much to start off with. Like, it's not a nice mist. I really, really want to love this because if you know me, you know that I love crystals. And Rose Quartz is one of my favorites. So I really want to love this product and hopefully I do. Hopefully I'm not disappointed. So I'm just going to let that. And prior to this, I had already moisturized my face. So, so we'll see. Okay, lately I have been loving mixing these two foundations. So it is my Smashbox Studio Skin Foundation with my Maybelline Dewy Smooth. The maple and fit me um this foundation alone i really do not like it neither do i like the matte one but i decided to mix these one day and i just really ended up liking that combination so that's what i've been doing You know what? I always do my eyes first, and this time I did my foundation first. Fuck. <laughs> I'm doing my makeup so backwards today, guys, but I just really... Okay, and for my... To prime my eyes, I am using the NYX Water... The NYX Proof It um, Waterproof Eyeshadow Base. Primer, whatever it is. And then I just pat that in with my eye. And then I just go in with translucent powder to set that. I am using the Kat Von D translucent powder. Okay, so I'm going to go in with my Anastasia Master Palette by Mario in the color Isabel. That same brush I'm just gonna go in with the color Violetta with that same palette the Mario palette and just put that on top but a little bit lower I'm going in with my Anastasia palette it's really fucking messy of the concealer I am going to go in with the Milani Ice in Caribbean Sea.
Okay, you know what? This time I tried the primer a little bit more, um, a little bit further, and it actually sprayed a lot better. So I think the first time I just did it too close. Then obviously letting it dry. When I did my eyeshadow, I got glitter all over, so I had to take off my foundation and start over because I fucked up in the first place. I always do my foundation after. I don't know why this time I decided to go the other way. Oh, my camera died, so what did I do off camera? So off camera, I drew the little hearts and I did the outline for for the tears and I contoured my nose. Again, I'm going to go in with the NYX glitter primer and then I'm going to go in with the NYX glitter brilliance and crystal. And that's what I'm going to cry off. Because, you know, I cry, I cry tears of glitter. snobby lip liner in hot red and line my lips just gonna go in with my lime prime and red velvet and so my camera died and other than that it ran out of memory so um i had to let it charge so pretty much i finished off the look i did um the other glitter tears and then i just added Red lipstick, I use Lime Crimes Red Velvet, and that pretty much completed the look. So here it is. Honestly, loved this look so much guys and i am obsessed i do not even want to take it off so thank you guys so much for watching honestly i don't know how the video is going to end up because i just really really suck at working with glitter i'm really messy so it kind of frustrates me like we had that whole problem with the foundation but it was fixed it came out good we're looking good so yeah even if you encounter little bumps in the road just keep on pushing so let's see how it turns out because I don't really, I don't know what, comment down below, honestly, I want advice. How do you guys stay clean with glitters? Because when I do any look with glitter, even if I just put some glitter in my inner corner, it's a complete mess. I get glitter all over the damn place. So let me know, how do you um, apply glitter? How do you work with glitter neatly? Because I can't do it for my fucking dear life. So help me. I feel like I was so into this look because I really just wanted to create the look that I wasn't really that much worried with recording. I was more into how my the actual makeup was going to come out. So, so I kind of slack there. But thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to check out Motel Bunny to link her down below. Check out her art. It's pretty dope. I just really love this. <laughs> but yeah check out her art um i'll link it down below go follow her if you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe i try to be pretty active on here but i do have times where i'm just like at my a for a little week or stuff but i'm really trying hard guys so just to bear with me